Unlocking the power of APIs, an API first approach explained. Hello, everyone. In today's video, we're diving into an exciting topic that's reshaping the world of technology and software development, the API first approach. Whether you're a budding programmer, a tech enthusiast, or just curious about how digital services communicate, you're in the right place. We'll break down this concept into simple terms and explore why it's becoming a game changer in creating flexible, efficient, and innovative software solutions. Stay tuned to unlock the power of APIs. Before we delve into the API first approach, let's clarify what an API is. API stands for Application Programming Interface. Think of it as a bridge that allows two software applications to talk to each other. It's like when you order food from a restaurant. You tell the waiter what you'd like, and the waiter communicates your order to the kitchen. In this analogy, the waiter acts as the API, facilitating the communication between you, the user, and the kitchen, the system. Traditionally, software development focused on building the core application first and then considering how it might connect with other systems or applications later. This could lead to issues with compatibility and scalability down the line. In contrast, the API-first approach flips this model on its head. Developers start by designing the APIs that will enable communication between systems right from the get-go. This ensures that the software can easily connect with other applications, leading to a more integrated, flexible solution. It's like planning the roads and highways of a city before building the buildings, ensuring everything is connected from the start. Adopting an API-first approach brings several key benefits. Enhanced collaboration. By defining APIs early on, Teams can work more independently on different parts of a project, speeding up the development process. Scalability. It's easier to add new features or connect with other applications since the groundwork for communication has already been laid. Future proofing. As new technologies emerge, an API first design makes it easier to adapt and integrate these innovations. So, how do you implement an API-first strategy? It starts with careful planning. Define your API specifications clearly, considering the needs of both the end users and the developers who will use your APIs. Use tools and standards, like OpenAPI, to document your APIs thoroughly. This documentation acts as a blueprint, guiding the development process and ensuring that everyone is on the same page. The API-first approach is more than just a development strategy. It's a mindset shift towards building more open, interconnected, and flexible software ecosystems. By prioritizing API development from the start, organizations can ensure their applications are built for the future, ready to integrate with whatever technologies and services come next. Thank you for joining us today. We hope this video has shed some light on the API-first approach and why it's such a pivotal concept in modern software development. If you found this information helpful, please consider subscribing for more insights into the tech world. Happy coding, and see you in the next video!